Hi, I'm Andrew Armstrong, and welcome to the back of his Teardown Lab. Today I have the EBIT Cam. This is currently available on places like Amazon, and it's a supposedly a cloud based IP cam, but sounds pretty much like a standard kind of, you know, pan tilt zoom internet activated camera but it seems to get reasonably good reviews and it's quite cheap if you get it in a flash sale for example you could get them as under tw under 30 pounds like you know 28 quid or something like that i think they retail around 34 pounds and similar price in dollars and uh, let's see what's in the box basically i'm just going to rip off all of the uh, packaging we don't, we're not really too interested in all that stuff are we might be interested to have a look at the card just to get the sort of wi-fi settings because i do believe it does have wi-fi so first things first this looks like a wall bracket so you would screw that to your wall like that and then you'll be able to lock that in place so that's quite cute um it does offer look at that that's a full well, over 90 degrees of vertical movement there, so it can look straight up. It can go almost, well, definitely the full 360 there. Allegedly it has zoom. I don't really know about zoom. It might be a kind of fake zoom. It doesn't look like a zoom lens, but who knows. Standard USB power and the ribbon ethernet cable and some raw plugs and some screws for that bracket. So that's kind of neat. They've given you all the sort of fittings. Um, yeah, it feels a little bit plasticky, but not so bad. It's, it's quite neat, actually. It's quite a small kind of size. Um, you see my hand, so it definitely kind of fits in your hand. Yeah, that's not too bad. So let's have a look inside because we, this is the teardown lab, of course, and uh, I feel I need to tear it down. I'm probably not going to, just to sort of pre-warn you, I'm probably not going to bother tearing apart the camera bit because there's not really much interesting in camera modules. It's literally just a lens on a piece of CCD on a circuit board. There's just, there's not really anything to explore on those. All the good stuff though will probably be in here. Well, there will be one thing in there that would be interesting. That's probably a motor that does that, but we'll see motors, we'll see motors. Ooh, right, so you've got a speaker in here, so this can do playback, so I suspect it has two-way audio. There's the motor, and it's going to be connected to a sort of radial gear ring, uh, which you can't see, but that's, again, nothing too uh, interesting. But it is a stepper motor, so that's interesting. So that's how it's getting all of that gearing, and that's going to move quite nicely. This PCB ribbon, I don't know if it actually slipped out from there, but it should be in there. I'm just going to be a bit ginger with it. So it's a 720p in this, but you can also get them in 1080. That is the digital connector to that. Now, see how they do it? They actually get a standard ribbon. You have a standard ribbon in there, and it's cut into lots of pieces so it can make a cable when you lay them up all together. So that's quite nice. There's the stepper motor driver. Microphone here on the front. There's a Wi-Fi antenna, USB Ethernet. Reset button right in there. Tink, tink, tink. Let's have a look underneath. And if I tilt it, you can see that's the PCB of the gubbins, and there is the processor with the heatsink on there. Okay, and don't really fancy taking it apart much more than that. Um, but we could have a quick play, couldn't we? Should we have a quick play on it? See if I can attach to it via my phone over Wi-Fi. I'm just going to pop though that. That wire. I don't. I don't know if it fell out of there, but certainly that's where it needs to live. That's where it's going back. Slips together quite nice. Yeah, it's like a really nice little design. Really, I think that's how it should be. Nice and simple. It's not doing anything massively complicated. Five volt DC, two amps. It says there. And I don't suppose it supports a power over Ethernet. And I'm just realising on the bottom you can see my serial number. So you'll be able to log into this one yourself and have a look, see. Hopefully not, only joking. Let's plug that in. I'm going to move it into a weird position to see if it does a kind of power on cycle. Oh, there's the uh, micro SD card, by the way, because it is a recorder. It's primarily a recorder rather than a streamer. 
This is insane. It's using cassette technology to talk. Into that crazy mode of it playing 8-bit, like to set audio fax machine to it, it can actually look at the QR code on your phone. How cool is that? That's pretty awesome. Apparently it's configured itself now. So I did try via the QR means and via the screamy sound means and both of them just seem to work quite well. So now it's got camera, router, server. So I don't know if it needs to sort of go on the internet and download something from its server, you know, like updates and whatnot. Um, but I guess you just wait, wait and see what happens. Let's just do that. Okay, great success. It took some, you know, a bit of fettling to be honest with you, but look at this. Mm. Maybe I should hold it this way, really. So you can see my office there and I'm, I'm kind of looking in the actual screen so you can move it by dragging it it seems robot camera yeah I think that'll do the trick good it has some sort of notion of local recording and stuff like that so I'm not going to go into it though that's this is not a review of the camera it just seems to work set it up works fine so I hope that's of some use to you get yourself an ebit cam if you fancy one a little bit plastic but fine I think that's okay as a sort of looking after your cat maybe keeping an eye on your kids or whatever but probably not so much for burglars unless you've got it indoors you definitely wouldn't want it outdoors it's not waterproof so I'm not it but yeah probably good for just general home security no idea how hackable or unhackable their server is be careful of that you never know as ever comment down below like share subscribe twitter thanks for watching